The Coast Guard calls off the search for a missing swimmer. Tonight, we know it's Rabbi Ruvain Bauman. He saved a student from a rip current yesterday, but never resurfaced. Thank you for joining us for 13 News Now at 6. I'm Janet Roach. And I'm David Allen. This all happened at the Back Bay National Wildlife Refuge. Swimming is illegal there, so there are no lifeguards. 13 News Now reporter Evan Watson is there tonight with more. The Coast Guard called off its search, but state and local responders are still searching for Bauman in helicopters, planes, boats, and SUVs. <laughs> Yesterday, Rabbi Ruvain Bauman came to this beach with 20 boys for an informal class trip. He rushed in to save a boy who was struggling with a rip current. The boy made it back safely, but Bauman didn't return to shore. The word of his missing went around the world immediately, and prayers began from what I understand, from Norfolk to the Wailing Wall in Jerusalem. Bauman is a father of five, a local Jewish leader and Torah scholar. Speaking for the B'nai Israel congregation, Joel Rubin says that everyone is reeling in despair. Rabbi Bauman was as good a person as you will ever know. Swimming is not allowed at beaches along the Back Bay Refuge, so there are never lifeguards on duty. The Back Bay director said school trips are common, but this one was unofficial and his team didn't know about it. Ruben says he doesn't know how or why anyone was in the water, but he says there was another man on the beach unrelated to the trip who helped save people yesterday. He doesn't know who that is. There was an angel on the beach uh, yesterday afternoon who prevented this from becoming a worse tragedy. The Coast Guard called off its search today just shy of 24 hours after Bauman was reported missing. Counseling will be offered for the boys on the trip. Ruben says people will continue to search for Bauman. You know, he'll leave a tremendous legacy in this community. You know, there will be, you know, time to mourn and remember. Right now, the focus is on finding his uh, body and giving him a proper Jewish burial. Evan Watson, 13 News Now. There are a few things you should know if you get caught in a rip current. First, don't fight it. Experts say you should relax as much as you can and float to save energy. Don't swim directly to the shore. Instead, swim at an angle along the shoreline until you are out of it. Remember, currents won't pull you under, just away from the shore. 